All right, hello everybody and welcome. I am the OG Geo Grey Guys, and thank you for joining me today. This is episode two of what is it? NHRA Speed for All. Uh, I think that's the title. I don't even, I don't even know. Uh, the NHRA video game. This is episode two. <laughs> if you missed episode number one, you can click the eye in the top right of the screen to go check that out. Um, make sure you like the video, share the video, subscribe to this channel, follow along with this and everything else we got going on. Make sure you turn in Thursday for our iRacing selection show, our Thursday Night Thunder selection show. If you have no idea what that even means, tune in and you'll find out. So, uh, as always, make sure you check out that video description for our link tree link to our great channel supporters and sponsors. Go support those that support us. Uh, yeah, I'm not giving up on, on this just yet. I, I screwed up royally <laughs> the first episode with uh, uh, how, how much I suck at driving. So, uh, let's go check out the garage here. Um, nothing really needs repaired or fixed or what have you. We do have some R&D working right now that should be done after this current race. Um, unfortunately, there's like you can't start something until something completes. So maybe once these two complete, I start one thing, and then that way, like at the end of every race day, I have something always going on instead of waiting two weeks for everything. Uh, maybe I, I I honestly don't know. So um, that's what's going on there as far as tuning is concerned I don't know the first thing about tuning. So uh, If anybody wants to help with that by all means comments below uh, I know several people have commented already uh, on the first video, but um, Yeah, I just want to make sure that I'm doing the right thing and not embarrassing myself, but I've probably already done that so um, from a store perspective, we have $21,179. I don't really think I'm gonna, uh, what can we do? We, I think last time we did body kit and parachute tires. We can't really do anything with, uh, if we upgrade the aspiration, uh, that moves our top speed from a 50 to a 75. So, uh, let, let's, let's do that. Uh, we're going to purchase that for, I think it was $2,900. Uh, and then our transmission or our gearbox, $10,000. So I don't want to do that just yet. Uh, let's head back to the garage, make sure our loadout is correct. So aspiration, where is that? Where is that? Am I blind? I feel like I'm blind. Uh, inventory, let's look at our inventory. There we go. Uh, equip part. Yep, we're gonna go ahead and hit accept. Uh, yep, so all those are there. Uh, I, can you sell stuff? I, I thought you could, but, uh, okay. I thought you could sell stuff. I don't wanna, I don't, I don't, I don't wanna equip that. No. All right, let's head back here. Uh, head to the next event. I don't know how many events we'll do. We might do one, or we'll do one for sure, but we might do two, so. Uh, our next event is... Tucson Dragway, so the NHRA Arizona Nationals. Tucson Dragway is a 110-acre venue that features a dedicated quarter-mile drag strip. It's one of the most active drag racing facilities in Arizona, featuring one of the largest shutdown areas in the country at almost three-quarters of a mile. Tucson Dragway is some of the fastest race cars in the world, so their shutdown area is twice as long, or three times as long, as the actual racing uh, surface. So... All right, Tucson Dragway is up next. Uh, don't have any R&D completing after this one. We it will They will complete after Gainesville. Um, right? Should complete after this one, though. Whatever. Uh, let's head to the track and get ready uh, at, at the track. Yeah, let's, let's, let's go race. All right, here we are in Tucson. Look at that beautiful scenery there. The mountains in the background. Uh, we're not going to do any test passes, mainly because I don't want to waste any money. Um, so we'll just go straight to qualifying. Look at my driver over there. He's he's all ready. He didn't even... He, he's he's always hyped. He never takes his, his helmet off. Helmet's always on. He's always ready to go. We're going to skip this one, though. Go straight to qualifying on Saturday. There we go. Qualification rounds on Saturday. Four rounds are scheduled. Here's the announcer, man. I hope you're as excited for the action as I am. I am, sir. All right, let's go ahead and start our qualifying here. Please don't make fun of me. I'm going to suck. 
Um, until I get like Welcome things figured out, Let's start the end of shift first skills. Roll forward. Roll forward. Roll through the, the water. The burnout down here. I think I get those tires up to temperature. Done that. Hold the brake and the throttle. Shift it into reverse. Tires are warm relatively to where exactly where we want them. First up, shift into first gear. Now let's slowly approach the staging lane. I forgot what button shifts. Oh boy, this is gonna suck. All right, here we go. We're pre-staged, staged. There we go. I, I, I remembered what button it was. Oh, there we go. I don't, I don't know if we were able to actually do well <laughs> with that or not. I know we were very close to the wall. Got to do better at keeping it straighter, but had a had a better reaction time, and we actually won this one. So we got the we got the win light. Uh, had a had a pretty good ET too. So ten two five zero. Let's see where that puts us on the board. All right. I hate that it goes straight to the replay. I will cut out replays, but we are top of the board. That's what I'd like to see. Head back to our pit area and go to garage. So I'm gonna repair the stuff that needs repairing. Um, now I know one person in the comments did say, hey, if your stuff's green, you don't need to repair it or spend any money on it. Uh, repairing just takes time. Uh, it doesn't take any money. So I'm not really worried about that. Uh, and if we're skipping this because we were first, um, we'll have to check out and see where things are. Oh wow, ninth! All right, well, we'll have to we'll have to run this round of qualifying because I don't want to be in ninth. Uh, you have not done any maintenance yet. Well, let's go let's go double check things. So the only thing we do is swap parachute and tires. I'm not gonna swap tires for a second round qualifying. Uh, so I sure want to continue. Yes, try to do a little better here, so keep the car straight. Um, now that I know which I have the right buttons, let's lay down a good, good path here. All right, there we go. Shift in reverse. Oh, there we go. 180 degrees, 179 degrees on the tire temps. That's what I like to see. 175 is ideal. So let's get back into the staging line. Right, here we go. Pre-staged, staged. Here we go. All right, feel like that was better. Feel like that was better. I at least know that tire temps were a lot better. 10, 2, 5, oh wow, 9.8 was a lot better. See, he had a lot higher uh, top speed. His ET was terrible. All right, there we go, back up to the top of the board. Only two drivers, sub 10 seconds. We are one of them. Uh, so we will skip. Qualifying four, and hopefully we'll stay at the top of the board. Uh, but before we do that, we'll go ahead and repair the stuff that needs repaired. Uh, repairing, again, does not cost any money. Only swapping costs money. Repairing takes more time than swapping, obviously. Uh, but swapping costs money, so there's a trade-off there. So we're going to go ahead and skip final round of qualifying and head to Sunday elimination rounds. Basically. Uh, it's elimination rounds. Let's go ahead and check out, see where we did end up on the qualifications. Ninth. Wow. Wait, no, I'm dumb. Uh, qualifying. There we go. There we go. All right. I wonder if I'm just that dumb and qualified that second time. Well, I shouldn't say for no reason, but we did qualify P1. So happy about that. Uh, let's go ahead and check the car right now. Parachute and tires. I'm not going to do tires for round one. I think we should be all right. Uh, as long as I don't screw the pooch like last time. Uh, but here we go. Let's go ahead and get round one of eliminations done here. We're going against Leon Butler. We are the top qualifier so in this uh, event. Right, let's go ahead and roll through the burnout box. 
Light him up. Light him up, 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 light him up, up, up. Alright, right, we got 182 degrees. That's what I'd like to see. Check the first gear, get into the staging lights. See if we can get a better reaction. We just continually need to work on that reaction time. Kinda hear the other dude, but I don't see him. Will they take on the Wally today? Stick I think we I think we advanced past the first round. Yay! <laughs> uh that's not something I should be super excited about, but hey. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. One point or wow, look at his reaction time. That is astounding. See the top speed is the thing that's really getting me. Like they're so much faster from a top speed perspective than we are, but we're getting our, our lap's time is so much better. So I don't know. Let's head back to the pits. All right, made it through the round one. Going to the quarterfinals now against Isaiah O'Neill. Isaiah qualified in the ninth position. He beat Nathan Miller. All right, so back to the pit area we go. Garage. Let's go ahead and repair everything that needs repaired. Repair. Here. We don't have enough we don't have enough time to do that. So we'll have to be a little more careful uh because the tires are gonna need some some love after this round. So go ahead and start this race. There's Isaiah in his whatever car that is. Uh it's a Chalmero Kamalinger. No, no, no. Oh, man. That's not what I wanted to do, but... Man. We'll have to... Uh, I mean, we have to roll with it. Not, I can't change it now. Not the greatest burnout, but... We'll see what we can make do here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. And I think we got it. We did. We got it. We got it. We got it. We got advancing through the rounds like butter right now. Car's running real good. Just going to have to do something with those tires for sure. All right. Beat Isaiah O'Neill. We're now going against Teresa Salazar. Uh, she beat Gracie Evans in the first round. Uh, she qualified fifth, beat Gracie Evans, and then beat Zane Hickman, the fourth qualifier. Uh, Teresa was the fifth player, like I said. So in the semifinals, final four, we're going against Teresa Salazar. Head back to the pit area now. Get ready for uh, semifinals here. Ooh, wow. Okay. So what do we... Oh, man. Ooh, boy. So we definitely need to... Okay, so... Torque, 5, 10, 15, 20... Ooh, man. All right, so the gearbox, I'm going to... Mm, do I want to swap it? I don't think so. Oh, man. So if I do swaps, I only have enough to do five of the seven. Was it one, two, three, four, five, six. Four of the six. But I've got five things that need help right now. It's five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So if I swapped everything, I would take up the exact amount of time that I need. Parachute doesn't really need it. So that doesn't really help me if I wanted to repair something. So, well, regardless, this needs swapped. Not really what I wanted to do. Tires need swapped too. So there's 10 minutes gone or 10 time units. I don't really know what you want to call them, but... Uh, so I got, if I want to, I got 15 minutes of swapping to do, but that's going to take money. Or if I want to repair, and I could, I could swap two and repair one. So which one is worse? Which one's going to cost more to swap? 
Uh, that's 580, 1040. Thir okay, so we will repair the engine and then swap the other two. Repair. Swap. Swap. All right, so we should be good there. Let's go start this final four against Ter so glad to see such oh a huge gosh. against Teresa. Go forward. There we go. Get through the burnout box here. Right. Up those good year eagles. There we go. 165 degrees. Not ideal, but closer than where we were last time. That is for sure. Let's now roll up to the staging lights. 10 yards, 5 yards. 4, 3, 2. All right. Here we go. Here we go. This will put us into the finals. Not the best, not the best uh, reaction time for us there. Keep forgetting that this is only four gears. Yep, and I think we were able to grab that and put ourselves into the finals for the first time after falling out in the first round last race. That was not ideal, but yeah, great race. Oh, wait, wait, oh no, 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 no. Ugh. Depending on the durability of your parts, there's a chance they could fail during the race. I wonder what failed. Uh, the lower the durability, the higher the failure chance is. Once a part fails, it will negatively affect the behavior of your vehicle. If during the race, you can choose to finish despite it or opt to pull the chutes to avoid further damage and stop your vehicle. A uh, surefire way to know if a part has failed is to check out the light-up indicators in the speedometer. Make sure to replace the failed part back in the pit. I wonder... Oh! The car exploded. I can't be good. All right, here we are. There is the bracket. We are in the finals against James Lawson. Sixth place qualifier, James Lawson. He beat Harmony Briggs in round one and then beat third qualifier, Christy, Kirsty Arley. Wow. Kirsty Arley uh, in the quarterfinals and then up against Bubba John in the semis advancing to the finals so we are going against james lawson let's head back to the pit figure out what broke on our car to cause it to explode the engine okay so it's the one thing that i swapped last time it's wonderful we're gonna have to swap that no choice there all right so now we've got 25 minutes and we've got one two three four things so Oh, that's not what I meant to do. All right, let's think about this. So if we swap everything, 5, 10, 15, 20, uh, that's 20 minutes, no or, um, oh, no issues there. We only have the ability to repair three items. So that would be 21 minutes. Wouldn't allow us to swap out the remaining items. So I think that's what we're going to do. I'm not going to do anything with the tires. I think they should be fine. So let's go ahead and repair uh what is that top speed aspiration let's go ahead and repair the body kit and we've got 11 minutes remaining we're going to repair the transmission or the gearbox so there we are we got four minutes remaining nothing else we can do finals time let's see if we get our first wally james lawson there going up against roll forward gotta get those uh those tires heated up that is goal number one right slide through all right Ooh, not as warm as i would like 162 and now we're getting kind of wonky out of line here all right there we go if we do first wait a minute what's going on here oh. they didn't back up far enough there we go slowly approach the staging line i need to uh, i lost my adapter my usb adapter for my steering wheel so I need to see if it'll work with this game, because that would be pretty cool. Alright, let's go ahead and get up here to the staging line. Here we go. Oh, did we get it? I think we got it. Yay. First win. Stick around for more action. There we go. We got our first this dub. Big day in this driver's career. Being presented with a Wally after that incredible race win. Yay! What is up with the shading on the car there? Oh boy, a nine nine five seven. 
in the final round. Oh, they got to do something about the lighting there. That is, that is odd. But we won, yay! And look at that, just like that. We grab our first win, our first Wally. Ah, oh, man, that was a good one. That's 10 1, but it's head more slower or faster than that after the race. So, not really sure what's going on there. Mario Hansen, there we go. Fourth in the point standings right now. We were terrible at first race. So, behind the eight ball, but we gained many, many points with that win. We beat the points leader in the, uh, or at least the current points leader in that uh in that final round so definitely happy with that sponsor goal progress one out of four on the lucas oil products two out of eight on the pet boys six out of 24 on msd and two out of 25 on racing and electronics uh so what do we got here uh season goal for lucas oil products reached the semifinals four times we've done that once qualify top five with pet boys we've done that twice we need to do that eight times uh, MSD wants us to win 24 rounds. It says races, but they want us to win 24 rounds. We've done that six times now. And <laughs> Racing Electronics wants us to crash less than 25 times. So, uh, we've, I guess we've crashed twice already. So, okay. But, all right. Let's, uh, let's continue on through this. There's Mario. Plus 200 experience points. That's weird. Driver gets a plus five bonus to all skills for the rest of the race weekend when seated in the 13th to 16th position. Oh. If you qualify bad, he gets a points boost. <laughs> and the level gain will be faster when signing this driver after the previous contract has ended. Uh, R&D results, so our R&D has completed. Okay, so week two, you see there, sponsor goal earnings, uh, race earnings, and all the part swap and parts buying and stuff like that so uh, i think this part's pretty cool it doesn't like actually charge you quote unquote until after the end of the end of the race so uh let's go ahead and continue through this all right back at hq after our first race win so what are we going to do now let's go ahead and go to the garage do you want to continue the race weekend without an active no there we go. Okay, so we upgraded the tires, or we did R&D on the tires, the transmission. I think what we need to do, so I think, going, uh, blah, blah, blah. I think what I am going to do is start one now, and then start one after, or before the next race weekend. That way I've always got one completing every weekend. Uh, so I think I'm going to do the, you know what? No, I'm going to do the yep we're gonna do this one we're gonna start researching that so we got that one that'll complete in two weeks and then next week we will start another one so there's that all right uh tuning I, i'm not gonna screw with him I and the car ran pretty good uh, i need to get a little better at keeping the car straight but i ran pretty good i'm sure this is gonna come in come in to effect uh, later on down the road, but uh, as of right now, I think we're all right. Uh, so now let's go back to the team store. We got a little bit of money now. I think we can make some make some upgrades, uh, specifically with the gearbox. So we're kind of crappy on that ten thousand three hundred three fifty. Let's go ahead and buy that new gearbox from Moser Engineering. I've got Moser parts on my car. Ah, oh, we can sell stuff. So you can sell parts you don't need in the store to get back a little bit of cash. Only parts that are in your inventory, not installed in your vehicle, will be available to sell. All right, so first and foremost, let's go back to our loadout and make sure that we get the gearbox installed. So switch part, we're going to put that one up. Look, it takes, okay, so it takes our transmission to an 80. It is at a 55 right now. So it goes from a 55 to an 80 with that, so... That was definitely, definitely worth it. So uh, let's head back to the store and sell uh, options here. All right, so we're going to sell the parachute, $300. We're going to sell body kit for $1,500. And then we're going to sell the aspiration for $860 and then Three thousand sixty dollars for the gearbox. So we got some money back from those purchases we just made. 
Uh, I haven't customized anything yet. If you guys want to see certain customizations, I'm leaning towards making everything this Electro Blitz, like Tron inspired stuff. But, um, cause like if you look at the hauler, like look at that, that, that looks phenomenal. <laughs> but, uh, I want to know what you guys think. Should we, should we do anything right now? I don't have a lot of stuff unlocked, so, so not really a whole lot I can and can't do right now. I wish there was a little more customization when it came to like, Hey, I want to name my team something like, how do I change my team? name? If somebody knows how to do that, please let me know. I do not like my team name, uh, because it's just literally your team. I want to change that. I can't figure out how. Uh, you see everything there. Uh, we got our first Wally there. Uh, so, um, definitely happy with that. 24 races here, I guess, in the first season. I don't know. Like, we've been recording for about half an hour now, so I'm not sure if making these two races long is, is worth it. Um, you guys let me know uh, what, what you think we should do here. Uh, are we going to show everything? Or are we not? Uh, are you know, what do we what do we want to do here so um but yeah i think that's going to do it for us here today episode two of nhra speed for all um we got our first win got our first wally so definitely uh happy with that but i am the OGGO greg osman thank you all so much for watching and we'll catch you next time